that. No, on the first day, we call you pay the bill, and that's that. If you ask me to pay that bill, I will walk out. I will not I, pay that bill. You still gonna pay for but it. But I wouldn't. But here's the thing. Like I said, the the question is, how do you get you a don't. woman? Don't. No, stop, Danny. How do you get it? I'm trying to tell you from a man who has done it. Right now, if your date was trash, no, you better not slide that bill. If you do not know how to get, I'm going to use a word that I don't like to use. If you do not know how to manipulate the woman, then you better not slide that bill over. But if you manipulated her to make her feel like she had a great date, first date, we're speaking on, not third then you can honestly have, the world is your oyster. You could pass seven bills to her if you had a great first date and she might bite the bullet on all seven. You know what's so funny? This guy had told me he forgot his wallet one time. And remind you, <laughs> I'm in a whole, like, you know, a five-star yeah. restaurant and now I'm looking like, damn, I didn't order mad drinks. I'm like, this is the first day. Now I'm going to have to pay for the bill. You know how stressed I was? And the way <laughs> I was really stressed. I'm like, God damn. And I had to pay for it because it's almost like I had to pay for it the way he said it. And I'm like, fine. So I paid for it. But you could tell my, my mood just changed. I'm like, yeah. in my head, I'm never going to hit him back up again. This is not how, it's not giving what I'm supposed to give. Right. So as I got home, because he had access for my cash shop. I thought he was lying just to play it off. So I, as I got home, and then the money was in my cash shop, and then he sent a little bit more. That's when I, I was kept about talking to say, did he him. send No, more? he sent it. I was shocked, because I thought he was trying to get away from it. I'm like, that's just some cheap stuff. No, he was testing the waters. See, like, here's the thing, right? Men Maybe on a second date, Rico, but I don't think anybody is to be tested on the first yeah, on the date. First date. But you you like me, right? Why are no. you testing me? Here's the thing. Why are you being weird to me? No, why are you being weird to me? Because here's the thing, Amanda, right? You got to think about it. Women nowadays go on dates even if they don't like the man. Facts. So how am I going to find out if you really like me? I'm going to test the waters. When I'm put in a difficult situation where I have to pay or we going to be washing dishes in the back, yeah, I'm going to pay. No, nah, that's not true. I'm some women will walk out and some women be like, bro, I'm not doing none of this. I don't like you like that. I didn't like you like that. I didn't even want to come here. I came here for the food and you don't got no money. Chow. And they're going to walk out. Women will do that. And then if he's left to foot the bill, then he's left to foot the bill. But what I'm saying is that when a man wants to know if a woman really, really likes her, he's going to test the waters sometimes. Not all the time. Every situation is different. Yeah, I don't think that works all the time because me, I'm not going to embarrass you. I'm not going to dish you and I'm not going to embarrass myself. I'm going to pay that bill, but you're just not going to hear from me again. Yeah, I mean, but then that's what you do. You hit it back in on the cash app. But, but even if even I mean, if you were to send me the money the next what? day with interest, I still am not going to fuck with you for what you did. Like I still had to. Why are you that irresponsible that you left your wallet? Why? But he said he said some women in our days will go for the food, but I feel like women been doing that. That's the chance you're taking. Women go for free food all the time. That's how I used to survive. If I'm going on dates for free, I used to go to dates because I was hungry. All the time. You got lucky, Danny, because you, you came into the world. Your generation is in the world where women will go on dates for free food. But you got to remember back then, even let's say 15 years before, mm -hmm. when you were a little kid, women were not just giving their time like that. So before a woman would be like, yo, if I don't like you, I have no intentions with you, or I have something else going on. I'm not giving you that time. I'm not going out on a date with you. I don't want to drink from you. I don't want to go on a date with you. Whatever, whatever. Now, the days have changed where women be like, I go on for free food. It's a more opportunistic <laughs> approach to It's dating. crazy because... Now, I used to do that when I was actually broke, go on dates. I done tried every restaurant in New York City, like top restaurant, because I was broke. I would go on these first dates just to eat food. But now that I got my own and I'm secure, like, if I don't like you, I'm not going on a date with you. You're right about that. If I don't like you now, I'm like, I don't care for the food. Because I done tried every restaurant now. I don't have to go to prove anything, and I'm not broke. I could pay for my own dinner. But before, when I was broke, I was going on dates for survival, to eat, like, whatever. And that's why he slid you that bill and you were stressed. You know what I'm saying? Like, cause that's what happens. See, like, as men, 
you got to realize that we're also expected to have certain things. We're, also, we're expected to have certain amounts of money to deal with certain types of women, right? So we have to have certain types of money. We have to have certain types of maybe respect or credibility, whatever, whatever, whatever. So when we go to these places that are to really impress you, right, or we go to a pr place that's just to have your time, sometimes a man wants to know, especially if I got money in my pocket, right, where I could go eat wherever I want to go eat, but I'm not about to just be going out to eat with somebody who has nothing to her name. So I'll slide you that bill. And maybe, maybe even if you're like, nah, that's all right. You got it. I'm not the type, I'm going to be honest, I'm not going to fight. Like, nah, you got it. No, I'm not going to do that. That's not me. But if I, but if the, I get that energy, I'll be like, all right, cool, whatever. I'm going to swipe, whatever. It's, not, it's nothing big. It was just a joke. But when you see a woman start sweating, and they start panicking and they leave to go to the bathroom, right? Whatever account they got to check. Um, that's when you start like, oh, this was game. You know what I'm saying? Like it allows you to start to understand where a woman's mindset really is. Because like I said, as a man, you got to protect your wallet because your wallet is what women are after nowadays. Okay, but... I don't feel like it always has to be game. I definitely know that for some women it is, but for some women, they literally just don't expect to have to pay anything on a first date. They're like, oh, okay, I'm going on a date with this guy. You know, I'm, I'm not really going to be spending X, Y, and Z. So yeah, I don't have to transfer from my savings today. Yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm good. That's like, your time to show out is, is the first date. That's your time to show out. I love when I go on a first date with a dude. I go to the bathroom and the bed is already taken, taken care of. I don't even got to see the bill. Like, yeah. I love that. that. That's such a turn on. When, when the bed is sticking, I went to the bathroom. Oh, you got to, oh, no, he's already taken care of. I'm like, oh, wow. That's impressive. I don't know if it's just tradition now or if it's just what men are expected to do. But I am expecting a man to pay Me too. for the first, the first date bill. The second time around, I'm going to be so impressed that you did it that I'm going to say I got the second one. Yeah, but like I'm going to tell you something from... I'm going to put myself in this category. From a high-valued man's perspective... Mm -hmm. Right, and this is just me putting. Uh, some people can say I'm not in that category. That's cool. Oh, that's it was right? him putting himself. But I in put the myself category. in that that's category, like, okay. right? Okay. So from a high value man's perspective, right, we are attracted to women that can actually, you know, take control of the situations, right? So if I put you in a situation and it's a joke and you push it back and I cover it, it's cool. But if I'm like, yo, you got it and you take it on, I have now become more attracted to you because I now know what you're here for. You're not here for my money. You're not here for my clout. You're not here for my credibility. You're here because you want to be here. But that's a but, lie. But, but, but hold on, right? Here's another thing, though. So um, men will never try or even joke or test the waters on a woman paying for the first date if a woman doesn't act or give the energy or the perception that she already got it. See, a lot of girls, women, I should say to, in today's era, are so independent and I'm gonna say masculated or emasculated that they come off with this big energy, like they can do what men can do. So sometimes men's gonna test you. Okay. You could do you you could do you think you that? All right, cool. Huh. But if you a man, like how I'm supposed to look at you as a man, mm -hmm. don't test me. Just That's show me saying. that you are but that you man know, that you, but you know you're supposed you're, to be. For me, it's the principle of the thing. That sounds poetic. It's, it's not poetic, it's real it's shit. Always it's always it's, no, it, 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 it is the principle. Poetic. It's the principle because you don't you don't gotta test me. Yes, I do have it, but I'm looking for you to have it. Because How does a man know you got it? See, look, at the end of the day, a man has to pay for the bills. So, and this is what I'm trying to say is that like the times have changed. The times have changed. Shit is not the same no more. I don't care what we want to call it. Like, we cannot use this. I hate when we use this traditional card when shit is not traditional. Part of my French. You know what I'm saying? But times have changed. So what I'm trying to say is a man is, a, is, is expected to pay on the bills and to do whatever he got to do. Now, I highly don't recommend a man to try to try the move on having a girl pay the first date if 
you know, the date isn't going good, or you can kind of see that the girl is not reciprocating the same energy that you're trying to put out. But if the things are going well, and if she is what she says she's about, if she is what she says she or what she's perceiving, it's a hundred percent okay to test the waters. A hundred percent okay to test because if you got it, then you look. I know I got it. If at the end of the day, if we end up being together, you gonna look at me to pay X, Y, and Z, right? Okay, well, but one, Rico, Rico what, you wanna go? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. What if the date is? What if the date is bad though? Then you don't ask. Actually, if the date is so bad, so if the date is bad, you're gonna go ahead and pay the bill just so you could. Get out of there. Honestly, here's what I'm going to tell you. If the date is bad and it was your idea and not my idea, you pay the bill. Oh, but because what you wasted my time. I didn't waste your time. What? It was your idea to go on this you date and this your... Listen, Which I'm not... Which one in? No, nah, no, like? because listen, y'all got... Listen, <laughs> if I'm it was mine, I respect my... Because I've been, on, I've been on dates that were terrible and I'm like, yo, this woman is trash. Like, she's... She's she's whack. I can't even. I don't even want to talk. I don't even want to look at her no more. Okay. So I, you think I'm gonna waste? I already wasted my time. Okay, and you and, better waste your money. And too. I'm not. No, I'm not about you to waste my. Waste your money. This is not a double whammy. It's either one or, or it's one or none. But so, you agreed to come outside, so it doesn't even matter whose idea it was to to be there. Because if I'm being for real. Most dates are men's idea. Yes. I agree. It's I, a man's idea. Yeah. So how you going to be asking me if I'm going to pay? Because I got it. See, you asked me to come outside. You I, pay the, the damn bill. Yeah, I, you, I'm how are you going to tell her? You're going to tell her like, yo, she got to pay the bill? I'm, uh, listen. Because the day, the day was trash. She, she feel the same way about you. No, she don't. Yes, she does. No, she don't. Yes, she does. I'm going to tell you something about me. You don't, think, you don't think a bad day Rico, is going to be mutual? If the day is going bad, it's not only in your part, it's in both parts. I'm not having fun either. I don't want to pay for that date either because I'm not having fun. That's even worse. Then we going 50-50 because- We're not going 50-50 I don't like you and you don't- We're not going 50-50 I do not like you and you do not like you. But you know what, Danny? If you even agreed to go 50-50, you know it's trash, he know it's trash, and you both not talking yeah, to each other face. no more. If I don't so like y'all you... got an even out but that's of I'm, the situation. It depends on the woman, because a woman like me, I'm going to walk out. You, the bid is on you. They're going to stop you. You're the I'm going to leave before you. No, no, you're lying. I'm going to be like, I'm going to go to the bathroom, and I'm out. Listen, I don't be one to make you're nothing out of embarrassing situations. No. I'm going to tell you, like, on a real situation, and uh -huh. this is being real, right? This is being real. Mm -hmm. and I told you. You walked out on a date. I know. No, I never walked out on no <laughs> date, right? But what I would, but I'm telling you, I'm not speaking for all men. Mm -hmm. I'm speaking for what I deem as a high valued you man. man. Okay. So as a high valued man, unfortunately, okay. unfortunately, guess what? Ladies, my time is just as valuable as yours. Okay. So since my time is just as valuable as yours, if you wasted my time and I wasted your time, it's either you're going to pay or we're going to split this bill because I'm not about to pay. But that's why she got to that pay? That sounds like a that. petty man, not a and high value first of man. All, how, why did like... the date go? Let's start with that. Why did the date go bad? It's not me. It's not me. This man. This so man. The thing is, and this is what I always talk about is accountability, right? So, like, let's be adults for a second. Okay. Let's not let's not buy into the hyper gender roles, yeah. and let's not buy into the hyper traditional roles because everybody here doesn't believe in traditional roles for certain aspects, okay. right? So let's actually be adults that have an open mind for a second. Okay. If I bring you to a place, or you bring me to a place, and we're not clicking. Right, me and you are not working out. There's something that is off. Mm -hmm. There is nothing wrong with saying, "Yo, listen, we don't work. We both took an L. Let's just chalk it up, and we're gonna split this bill and go our separate ways." But you said you're a high value man. It's just a couple of dollars. But it doesn't matter. But but now we're gonna go back to what Amanda said, and we're gonna talk about principles. Right, so like it's not even about the money because people who go out or go out to eat with me knows I'm usually the first to try to pull my card out to pay a bill. That's just how I am because I'm not the type of person to let somebody have a bill. I don't even feel comfortable letting people have a bill. However, if the date is not working, if the date is not working, and I Rico Hundo feels like I am wasting my time. I am not going to cover yours because I've already invested once. I'm not going to invest it twice. I just feel like that's being cheap. Just oh. pay the date, 
and just leave. Just do that as a why, man. Why can't you just, try to date Just be a man. Be a man. Okay. You're not being a man. And you said, are oh, you testing the water by making her pay the bill, you know, to see if she got it. I know women that go, when they're going on a date, they wear their most expensive shoes, bags, act like they got it to get high value, to get a high value man. They would do stuff like that and just to show you. But they're really after your money. And that's why we do what we do, fellas. Because we got women like that. Like that, that walk into our that walk into our atmosphere, hop into our car or hop into our Uber, and they go with us to the dates because they got they got on a bag shoes or heels and a dress that some other dude has bought, and they act like they got it, and then as soon as you put that bill in front of their face, all hell breaks loose. Now I'm telling you from a guy's perspective in which this has really happened when a girl takes the bill. And I slide it like you got it. It's not a hundred percent. I'm not saying it always happens. Mm-hmm. It's just like no, you got it, Nate. You so got you do it. it. You and do I it all take the time? it. I, not all the time. Like I said, it depends on a the woman. A few times you do it. I, yes, and honestly, at this point in time, I'm a different breed. I didn't graduated from testing the waters because I get asked to go out on dates. Oh, you get asked. I get asked to go out on dates. <laughs> hey, let me show you how I'm. I'm I'm being dead ass serious with you, Danny. I'm being dead ass serious. I'm not playing. Okay. I'm dead serious. Okay. Women women come to me and say, "Let me show you how I'm different." Ooh. And I take you out on a date. Okay, you see Where that do you want to go? Okay, you see what with women giving that big dick energy? Yeah. You would think that they're paying. So, you know, I get it. If I know he got it, I'm going to pay for it. I know I'm, eventually I'm going to get it back cuz I know he got it. That's my he point. He got the money. Like, I know that. If I know I'm going with a broke dude, then he's like, no. But if I know I'm I'm sitting next to, God forbid, like a high-value man, like, you know, I know he's sitting on millions, of course you could. I'd be like, I would eat a tip $100 if I got to. <laughs> <laughs> I would. Like, okay. That's what I'm saying. Well, guys. I'm accustomed to better, and that's what I'm accustomed to is that type of woman. So that's why I Well, say guys, that. I just want to say I agree with the fact I, I think that Rico answered the question. I think that asking to split the payment on the first date really solidifies that you both did not enjoy, and that's the only way to ask a woman to pay for the bill. You guys both did not enjoy. You guys are splitting that bill, and you guys are going your separate ways. I do not agree with asking or testing a female on the first date if you liked her and you enjoyed the date. I don't agree. So with that being said, fellas, know your work. Do not let a girl trick you out your pockets. It's your man, Rico Hundo. Hey, listen, test the water so you know she's really for you and not for your pocket.